If I want to become a video editor to edit file, what will I do? Where will I start? What software will I learn? How will I practice editing? Where do I get all the videos for that? So in this video, we will answer all the questions and more. I have prepared a complete roadmap to guide you how to become a skilled video editor in 2025. I know there are tons of other videos about this topic, so you might feel confused or have unanswered questions. Don't worry, this video will help you with the right knowledge to decide whether the video editing is the right career path for you. If you are new to the channel and you find this video useful, consider subscribing. So without any further ado, let's get into the video. Why do you think you need to learn video editing? It all comes down to two main reasons, personal and professional. Personal means that you might want to edit videos you have taken whether for your YouTube, Instagram Reels or for your own business. Whether it's a hobby or part of building your own brand, learning video editing helps you take control and add unique tests to your every frame. Now, let's talk professional. If you're looking to break into the world of media, marketing or content creation, video editing is your ticket to success. Mastering this skill can open doors to incredible opportunities and turn your creativity into profession. It's in high demand job you can easily make six figures as a video editor. There is no limit how much you can earn according to your ability. What device are you going to use for editing? Whether it's mobile or PC, the device you choose could make or break your editing workflow. So what's the right choice? Let's find out. First thing first, if you are aiming for professional video editing, let me save you some trouble. Don't rely on mobile device. Sure, it's fine for editing quick reels or small videos for social media, but beyond that, it's just not built for that job. But here's the thing. If you're working on content for clients or want top tier quality, the difference becomes crystal clear. Take something simple as background removal. Use the mobile app like CapCut and compare the results of the pro software like Premiere Pro. You will see and feel the difference. So with your clients. It's not just about the quality either. Think about storage. Short videos, mobile might handle it. But for a long form content like YouTube, podcast or anything that involves a massive raw files, your phone storage will hit the limit fast. A PC or laptop, they build for this heavy lifting. So here's the verdict. If you're serious about video editing, whether for clients, YouTube or just creating top-notch content, just invest in laptop or PC. But hey, if you're just creative for fun, short videos for social media, your mobile got you covered. Which software are you going to use for editing? There are tons of apps like VN, CapCut, InShore that are perfect for personal use or short edits. But if you're aiming to edit professionally, you need to step up your game with these three powerhouses. One Premiere Pro, two DaVinci Resolve and three CapCut PC. In Premiere Pro, everything you need in a one tap. Intuitive and packed with the features. It's the go-to for many professionals. Next up, DaVinci Resolve. A master of specialization with the separate pages for importing, for editing, for fusion effects, for color grading, and audio. Perfect for those who love structured workflow. CapCut PC. Simple yet powerful for beginners to step into the professional editing world. While these tools share the same fundamental features, the way they handle the task like timeline and color grading sets them apart. For example, DaVinci Resolve use nodes instead of layers for color grading. A unique approach compared to the other editing softwares. So which one should you choose? This is my personal opinion. If you want to master video editing, stop overthinking and just pick Adobe Premiere Pro. Why? Because it's industry standard. Once you get better at Premiere Pro, then learn After Effects. You will also get the advantage of being in the Adobe suit with the Photoshop and Illustrator. And we all know Adobe has its own drawbacks. It can crash and price might sting a little, but the value of learning industry standard softwares far outweighs the negatives. Stop worrying about the perfection and start learning the skills that will make your content to the next level. Where can I learn this software? You don't need to spend a single penny or enroll in expensive courses. Everything you need is right at your fingertips. Let me show you how to get started. If you are a beginner, YouTube is your ultimate classroom. There are countless free tutorials for every video editing software out there. To make things easier, I have included links to some of the best YouTube channels in the description. Check them out and start learning today. Now, before you dive into the advanced editing tricks, you need to learn the basics. Think of it like a building a skyscraper. You need a solid foundation for everything to stand strong. Here's what I mean by basics. Learn to make simple cuts. Master Ripple Deletes
sync audio with video seamlessly. Work with multiple audio and video tracks and learn to synchronize them effectively. Start small and these building blocks will take your editing to the next level. Next, focus on shortcut keys. Shortcut keys are the secret weapon for any editor. They make your workflow faster and help you advance mastering techniques with ease. I have added links to the shortcut key guides of three popular video editing softwares in the description. Check them out. Where do I get the videos to edit? Number 1. Record your own videos. Start simple if you have a camera or smartphone. Create your own raw footage. This not only gives you complete control but also teaches you how to deal with unpolished clips. A must-have skill for any editor. Number 2. Use podcast clips. If you don't get anything, watch the podcast. There are a lot of 30 or 40 minutes podcast. You can edit some of the part for short form contents with the help of free stock videos. You can get it from Pixbay, Pixels or Videbo. With these, you can start practicing right away. Share your edits with the content creators and see your work go live. Number 3. Create Montage. Montage are the fantastic way to practice singing visuals to music. Think travel montage or motivational edits. Work on magic clips to beats. Use a transition like fades or zooms for smooth flow. Adding test overlays to highlight key moments. It's all about creating emotion and rhythm. Number 4. Edit short films. Challenge yourself with the storytelling. Edit a 1 minute short film about a day in the life or create a silent story brought to life with music. Focus on pacing and continuity. Adding sound effects for mode. Use a transition to guide the viewer seamlessly through the narrative. Number 5. Practice interviews or vlogs. Work on multi-track editing by cutting a mock interview or vlog. Start with the singing audio and video perfectly, removing filler words and pauses. Adding captions, name tags and b-roll to enhance professionalism. Number 6. Try commercial or ads. Get creative with short high energy edits. Edit a 30 second ad for a fictional product or a local business. Focus on fast cuts to grab attention, highlighting key product features, singing music and visuals to build excitement. Number 7. Long form content. Ready for a bigger challenge? Get it long form projects like podcasts, documentaries or webinars. Master organizing and singing multiple tracks, combining interviews and b-roll into a cohesive narrative. Crafting engaged 10 minute podcast episodes. Remember the best way to improve is try anything and everything. Keep editing, experimenting and push your boundaries because that's how you truly grow as an editor. Here's a powerful exercise. Watch a film for the fun for the first time. Watch it again with your editor's hat on. Not every cut, transition and effect that catches your eye. Break it down. Why does it work? How was it executed? Next time you edit for a client, refer to your notes. See if you can integrate one of these techniques into your project. Over time, you will build a toolkit of advanced skills you can rely on. Finally, when do I start editing? Uh, right now? Why wait? If you have a passion for video editing, if that's something that truly excites you, there is no better time to jump in than today. From Instagram, YouTube or LinkedIn, Every platform is craving great video content. You don't need a fancy degree, there is no age restriction, and the earning potential is sky high. Six figures as a video editor, completely doable. You can also get an opportunity to work from home. You are in control of when and where you work. So don't overthink it. Grab that footage, fire up your editing software, and start creating. Yeah, and that's it, ladies and boys and girls. If you find this video useful, give a like, share, subscribe. Check out these two videos right here, and I will see you on my next.